My name is Anubhav Kethi and this video is about RFID step. RFID stands for Remote File Inclusion which allows an attacker to execute any external script. So as you can see out here this parameter is vulnerable to RFI. So if I just type out here google.com and see the page will open. The Google's page is opening inside this uh, PHP page out here. So what I can do, I'll just create a small script in my Parrot or operating system. So let's go inside slash for slash html and out here I will create a script. Just say the one name will be something like as a PhD for example and Oh, just for instance, let's say the <coughs> the server got a netcat uh, running in it, so I can utilize that netcat to get a reverse shell from the web server to uh, my parrot out here. So I'll just execute this command out here. Let me confirm. Let me confirm my IP address. Uh, 192.168.0.102 and let's listen on port double port 3 okay. so just cross check the script ok good enough and then I'll start my Apache server Start the netcat listener at port 403. So, again, from the browser, I will just fetch that page. One through two, and the file is s.txt. So, as you can see, it is stuck out here, and in the terminal, I got a connection. So if I just see ls um, name okay. I got a reverse shell just by using a simple method just by creating a script and writing a normal PHP code in it. Uh, you can do it in multiple ways like you can use Metasploit to do it. Okay. So that's all for today. Uh, if you like my video, please uh, subscribe to this channel and share it. Thank you.